It's Eduardo Almonte. Um, today I got to start in Crooked State, Pisayola. So I got to stay here. I got olive oil, salt, pepper, garlic, mushroom, onion, green pepper, prawn tomato, and tomato paste. So we started a little bit olive oil. Starting the sauce. Way to get a little hot, so you want to shut it off. Um, we got it started saute your garlic. Eight more soon. Okay, now I say something a little bit and I stay. There we are. Salt, pepper, a little bit of salt, pepper, and a sauce. So you let that cook for about five to ten minutes? Yeah, we saute together a little bit of brown and um, ate a lot of tomato paste and uh, prawn tomato. So and I saute a little bit individual uh, steak okay. and ate it in the sauce and cook a little bit in the sauce. You know, that takes the flavor for the best and everything. Very nice. So it seems like you have a lot of experience with Italian cuisine. You worked in Italian restaurants before? I think yeah. Wow. Tell, tell us about that. Yeah. Tell us about the uh, places you work. What do you do? Uh, that's um, they call it uh, Papa Your Restaurant. That's in 450 Coma Road, Deer Park. And you worked there that whole time? Yeah, I worked there for uh, before I worked full time, six days in the week, and. Uh, now, only now work one day in the week, so. Is it a popular dish at the moment, Big Pizza Oli? Is it a popular dish? Big Pizza Oli, we have it uh, only for the catering. Oh, we do in the catering, you know, yeah. 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 So, um, we made a hope, uh, hotel pen, mm -hmm. finish in the oven, and for the catering, you yeah. know. Mm -hmm. So now, I ate a little bit of tomato paste. and the plant for my
was delicious, all those vegetables and the garlic. Yeah. And next, uh, we do a little bit of olive oil. Wait to get a little warm. Mm -hmm. Okay, So what's the next step now? We're gonna sear the uh, We gotta meat. seal the meat and um we see we combine it and let it cook a little bit and uh and all the vegetables. Let it cook and take it yeah. all the flavor. What type of um, cut of steak do you usually use for steak pizza only? Uh normally in the restaurant we use a um, flank steak. Flank steak? Okay. Yeah. Cause we seal whole piece and uh, mm -hmm. slicing. Put the pan and the sauce on the top and bake in the oven. Thanks, very nice. Yeah. What are some of the other popular catering dishes there that sell very nice? Oh, the, oh, the catering dishes yeah. over there? That's how they do uh, so the regular chicken francais, chicken masala, okay. uh, veal, masala, veal, palm, veal, uh, calapeno, um, chicken and calapeno. Chicken pan, chicken, uh, um, oh, that's wow. a lot, a lot of this. Uh, yeah. I'm sure the residents would like to try one of those dishes. Yeah. Then you got the pan nice and hot. Yes. Yeah. Cook for like three to five minutes. Yeah, it's, uh, you got a little yeah. salad, brown salad. Any deglazing, or you're just going to add the vegetable juice? Yes, the best one juice. Okay. Yeah, you can save it over pasta, um, um, mashed potato, uh -huh. um, rice, okay. anything where you can combine. Very nice. Okay, that's a brown now, I ate it. That's a big one, that's a little bit of this one. There you go. Yeah. When all those flavors come together now, right? Yep, yeah. now. That's where the magic happens. The garlic, the tomatoes, the peppers, mushrooms.
faster. You can save it a little bit faster. I like the little twirl, it gives it height, right? It gives it a little height. Yeah. yeah. Okay, it's a great presentation of the plate. Fresh basil. A little fresh basil. That's a great. state pizza, y'all. 